Sidney Powell, who's part of President Trump's legal team. Sidney, before we went to the break, we talked about you said that there may have been kickbacks to some uh, people who accepted the Dominion software. Tell me what you mean. Well, I mean, we are collecting evidence now from various whistleblowers that are aware of substantial sums of money being given to family members of state officials who bought the software. I mean, we're talking about $100 million packages for new voting machines suddenly in, in multiple states and benefits ranging from financial benefits for family members to sort of what I would call election insurance. Uh, because they know that they can win the election if they are using that software. It's really an insidious, corrupt system. And I can't tell you how livid I am with our government for not paying attention to complaints even brought by Democrats, Carolyn Maloney, uh, Elizabeth Warren, Amy Klobuchar, over the last several years in written letters with uh, expert reports and some documentation of how corrupt this software is, and nobody in our government has paid any attention to it, which makes me wonder how much the CIA has used it for its own benefit in different places, and why Gina Haspel is still there in the CIA is beyond my comprehension. She should be fired immediately. Which, which governor or which government official accepted hundreds of millions of dollars in benefits for their p family as they took on this software. If I said hundreds of millions of dollars there, I misspoke. I don't know the exact amount of money yet. We are still collecting the evidence on that, but it's more than one. Okay, so y y you, you can't say who you believe took kickbacks. What is the CIA's role? Why do you think Gina Haspel uh, should be fired immediately. You're saying that the CIA is behind the Dominion or Smartmatic voting uh, software as well? Well, the CIA and the FBI and other government organizations have received multiple reports of wrongdoing and failures and vulnerabilities in this company's product. Their own manual, if you sat down and read it, would explain how and why no honest person would use this system. And it's not just Dominion. There are other companies in the voting machine business in this country, too, that may very well and are likely using the same software. We've detected voting irregularities that are inexplicable and align with these problems in other states that think they have valid systems. But the people who bought the Dominion system for sure knew exactly what they were getting. It should never have been installed anywhere. And we are going to show the public exactly how rotten the entire state is. Now, I have spoken with a few whistleblowers myself this weekend. And one source who is an IT specialist told me that he knows the, the software and uh, specifically advised people in Texas, officials in Texas, not to use it. And yet he was overruled. Uh, he said that there was an unusual patch that was put into the software while it was live. And it's highly unusual to put a patch in there. Is that what you're referring to? Tell me how it's done and how these back doors work. Okay, that's part of it. They can stick a thumb drive in the machine or upload software to it, even from the internet. They can do it from Germany or Venezuela even. They can remote access anything. They can watch votes in real time. They can shift votes in real time. We've identified mathematically the exact algorithm they used and plan to use from the beginning to modify the votes in this case to make sure Biden won. That's why he said he, he didn't need your votes now. He would need you later. He was right. I mean, in his demented state, he had no filter and he was speaking the truth more than once, including when he said he had the largest voter organ voter fraud organization ever. Well, it's massive election fraud. It's going to undo the entire election. 
and they can do anything they want with the votes. They can have the machines not read the signature. They can have the machines not read the down ballot. They can make the machines mm. read and uh, catalog only the Biden votes. It's like drag and drop whatever you want, wherever you want, upload votes. Yeah. In fact, we've got math in Mi Michigan and Pennsylvania, I think it is, that all of a sudden hundreds of thousands of votes at a 67% ratio for Biden, 23% for Trump, yeah. were uploaded multiple times into the system. And, and Sydney, you say you have an affidavit from someone who knows how this system works and was there with the planning of it. You you believe you can prove this? In yes. Court. Oh oh yes, we have a sworn essentially a sworn statement from a witness who knew exactly how it worked from the beginning, why it was designed to work that way, and saw mm -hmm. when things started shutting down and they started you know stopped counting the votes here. That was the same play that had worked in other countries. Wow. This, this is explosive, and we certainly will continue to follow it. Sydney, thank you so much for your work. We will uh, be catching up with you soon. Thank you so much. We'll be watching. Thank you, Sydney Maria. Powell. You can be assured Rudy and I will stay on it. Okay. Thank you. Coming up, it is